Hello, my name is Dr. Phil Boyle, and I want to tell you about neofertility restorative fertility treatment. During our introductory presentation, I refer to peer-reviewed evidence that couples who complete treatment in our program can expect a 52.8% live birth rate. This is the average for everybody we see. Those with a history of previous IVF and an average female age of 37 years can expect a 32.1% live birth rate. We can achieve an 80.6% live birth rate for couples with recurrent miscarriage. So, what is different about neofertility treatment? Hopefully, a case presentation will give you some insight into our multifactorial restorative approach. Couple 9232 presented to our practice in January 2017, trying to conceive for seven years with a female aged 40. They had no previous live births and never conceived naturally. They had a diagnosis of unexplained infertility. She had a regular cycle and previously used hormonal contraception for 10 years. They had one previous cycle of intrauterine insemination and two stimulated cycles of IVF with embryo transfer on two occasions, resulting in one pregnancy that ended in miscarriage at seven weeks. Blood results were normal for her age. So that was her challenging history. Initially, with neofertility, we found four factors that adversely affected fertility, and we treated all of them. Suboptimal ovulation. This is a new concept. With neofertility, we can interpret the quality of ovulation. Although this woman was ovulating, her progesterone levels were below our target normal range, indicating poor quality ovulation. This makes it harder to conceive and increases the risk of miscarriage. In addition, we found clinical endorphin deficiency. She had a cluster of negative symptoms with PMS, fatigue, low mood, anxiety, and difficulty sleeping. When we stimulate endorphin levels with treatment, these negative symptoms commonly disappear and fertility improves. We took a blood test for IgG food antibodies and based on our blood results, eliminated milk and eggs from the diet. Clinically, we have used this approach for over 12 years and see improved outcomes when we adjust the diet in this way. Many experts do not agree with IgG testing due to a lack of publications, but clinically, we are happy to recommend this. Finally, we measured salivary cortisol and DHEA and found low levels of DHEA, which was treated. The following is a copy of the prescription we used to balance the cycle and restore optimum fertility. After a few balanced cycles in our program, we achieved a positive pregnancy test for the first time naturally after seven years of trying. Sadly, she miscarried very early before five weeks. So we had more investigations and recommended additional treatment. We found three additional factors that were also previously undetected. Stage three endometriosis was diagnosed by laparoscopy and surgically removed. This is her first operation to explore and treat her fertility. We also found elevated NK cells, which are associated with increased risk of miscarriage. We recommended treatment with prednisolone during her next pregnancy. Finally, we recommended treatment with sympathomimetic medication every morning. This reduced inflammation and was reflected in reduced joint pain, improved mood and energy. After a few more cycles, we achieved another positive pregnancy test. We closely monitored hormone levels every week for the first three weeks of pregnancy. We continued medical treatment as needed, and this time blood results were encouraging. We had a beautiful pregnancy scan at eight weeks and one day, with a clear strong heartbeat of 174 beats per minute. Hormone monitoring and treatment continued during pregnancy, and finally, we had a healthy baby delivered at full term, weighing seven pounds, 14 ounces, 3.572 kilograms. 
Hopefully, this gives you some insight into what is different about neofertility. Interestingly, this couple have a good chance of achieving a second successful pregnancy now that we have discovered what is needed to balance the cycle and restore fertility. Thank you for taking the time to listen to this presentation. If you would like more information, check out our website, www.neofertility.ie.